After the world was stricken by the pandemic, we all needed a bit of positivity and the Boring Channel does exactly that with random acts of kindness. This video is dedicated to the Boring Channel. Today we're gonna dive a little deeper into this content creator, but before we begin make sure to hit that subscribe button and press that notification bell. Kevin Hansen is the man behind the Boring Channel and he also has two other channels, Lawn Care Juggernaut and The Cabin on the Hill. Originally from Nashville, Arizona, Kevin seems to have moved out of his parents' house to live in Catoosa, Oklahoma. Their channel Cabin on the Hill Homestead is the niche where Kevin and his father come together to work on the undertakings as a team. Kevin is married to a lovely lady, Rachel Hansen, and they're expecting. He's a simple down-to-earth guy doing his best to keep his neighborhood clean and tidy. He does everything, and even though these daily necessary chores might be wearing out on a lot of homeowners, he does it in such a way that it surprisingly looks kind of satisfying, almost like an ASMR. The machines he utilizes immediately removes all the dirt and difference is night and day. Even though his fees could go pretty lofty, he sometimes does it for an absolute zero dollars. The Boring Channel joined YouTube on the 27th of April 2014 and made his first upload about a year ago on the 27th of November 2020. Since then, they've managed to gain a massive fan following of 394,000 subscribers, and it's amazing to think how 73 videos uploaded to date have racked up more than 4,100,000 views overall. This means that the channel is going pretty strong and they are some of the fastest growing channels on YouTube. Statistics say they get about 53,000 views per day on average, and Kevin is growing his online community by 400 subscribers per day. Kevin is very verbal about his life, and we as viewers can relate to him on a profound level as his sincerity and humble nature is what makes him one of the most authentic people on the platform. He previously spoke about the situations in life, how it's been implicating him and his upload frequency. Well, that's life, and Kevin is going through changes and developing through moments that are affecting his life in crucial ways. He said that he has been upset for months and I'm certain that we all have been there at some point in our lives. That feeling that you just want to lay on your bed and stare at the roof thinking about life and where you stand in it. The voiceover in specific is the main highlight of the channel and not being in the right mind space can reduce the content quality. Kevin is very critical about what he says. Well, it's the internet, and with an audience as massive as his, there's a great chance that he could get misunderstood, and he would never want to be someone that seeds a negative plant in someone's life. But the online community he has created with spontaneous acts of compassion and comforting others, he's been able to reflect light into his internal anguish and developed a way for him to find harmony. He's been able to get a lot of things done, but as he says, healing is an ugly process, but it is necessary. Kevin was on a week-long vacation at his friend Al's home, cutting some properties and soaking all his problems at a beach in Florida. Kevin is indeed a pure soul, and his household of three is expecting a fourth by November. I mean, we all need halts at times, and I would like to wish him prosperity in all of his endeavors. He's been able to give away a brand new mower in Louisville, Kentucky, and then spend two weeks doing what he loves. The world has been an economic war zone lately, where everyone is in a race, and then there's Kevin spreading positivity. I'm sure it helps him to heal others, and in the process, heal himself. So that's gonna do it guys, thank you so much for watching, subscribe for more updates, and we'll see you in the next one.